comet breeze, the mesa to the western skies with the sound of a thousand cattle drive. A chosen few would see the light and find the wrong with right. Up on the mesa, high above the clouds, there's a world apart from all the rest. On the mesa, live the real cowboys, standing up for law and order. Living by the code of the West Cleaning up the territory Keeping evil on its toes Takes a different breed of ride Rope and brave heroes On the Mesa Live the real cowboys Standing up for law and order And living by the code of the West The cowboys of Mesa, we uphold the code of the West. Since the comet done come down, raise my Mesa from the ground. We, we walk, walk talking right like all the rest. Ah! We're the cowboys of Moo Mesa. I'm the marshal that everyone calls Moo. Name is Colorado. Yeehaw! That's kid to you. That's Dakota over there. Tough as all cow anywhere. Yup. On this mesa we call moon. <laughs> Going somewhere, boys? It's Moo! It's Moo, Montana! Right both times. Colorado, let's teach these boys the ropes. You betcha, buddy. Come up, Dakota. Three cheers for the marshal! <laughs> Yeehaw! Marshal Moo Montana! There ain't a better lock out this side of Curious Gorge. Well, thank you, Calfine. I appreciate the appreciation. <laughs> but like it says in the Code of the West, if you get a big head helping people, your hat won't fit. I like that. Right, Marshal Moo. Magnificent job, Montana. It's always a pleasure to watch a true hero at work. <laughs> Marshal Moon always gets his horny toad. Well, it wasn't just me, Mayor Baloney, but all of the cowboys. Well, we're lucky to have such a sterling example of law and order in our midst. I, I, I had a little nest egg in that bank myself, and thanks to you, it's still safe. Well, we were just staying true to the code of the West, Mayor. That's our job. Protecting the innocent and good folk of Moo Mesa from those varmints that would perpetrate evil. Sorry, I get riled up just thinking about it. Me too. 
I despise a law cow who prevents me from becoming richer. Don't I know it. Why, terrible, my dear Sheriff. You just gave me one glorious bovine inspiration. Come again, boss. What would you think about seeing Marshal Moo Montana blown sky high tomorrow when he picks up his trophy for Law Cow of the Year? <laughs> What's the guarantee he'll win? Has he ever lost? Hmm. Good point. In the meantime, I think the mask bull should pay a little visit to uh, the noon train. up with the slightest bump. Allow me to demonstrate. <laughs> now you two, you two get that nitro into the wagon. I got me a marshal to fry. <laughs> <laughs> So that's why the noon train's late. It's stranded. Well, we got us a problem here. The 145's on time. For once. The 145 will never see the noon train in time to stop. Yep. Hey! Hey! I can see our house from here, guys! Uh, guys? Hey guys, wait for me! We've got a train to save. on this thing. Huh? Oh, don't get up. I'll find them. Mm. Mm. Oh, wrong one. Oh! 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 Oh!
What's up? What's, What's going on? Looks like you're gonna be early. Good work, Dakota. Lives have been saved and schedules have been kept. But uh, where's Colorado? <laughs> well, if that don't beat all. Yep. Dakota, you and Colorado follow the wagon tracks. I'll head into town and see what our share of terrible is up to. Somehow he always knows more about the mass bull than anybody else. Now wait a little minute. Just because I said your horse had better manners than you doesn't mean he can sit here neither. Well, 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 look who's here. Well, how to move? Looks like you could use yourself a sarsaparilla. Much obliged, Miss Lily. Well, come on in and wet your whistle. Your days are numbered, Marshal. Who oh, you got the drop on me, calf pint? Can I help you catch bad guys now, Marshal Moo? I'm getting pretty fast. You sure are, Cody. How about you start by wearing this? Golly, a real deputy star. Now say there, Cody, how's that long cow of the year flow to coming along? It's gonna be the most rodeo and float in the parade. You're gonna look good riding on it too, Marshal Moo. Now how about we let the good folks of Moo Mesa decide who rides the law cow float when they vote, okay? Yeah, but you win every year. Cody, now there's more streamers and balloons in the stable, so why don't you go out and get them and, well, you could use all you want. Yeah, cause I'm gonna need all of them. Say there, you gonna pick up your award this year, Marshal, or just gonna avoid the whole matter like you usually do? Well, Lily, like it says in the Code of the West, trophies may look good on the shelf, but they sure make your eyes look pretty. Uh, but they don't make the sagebrush grow. Read them and wait, boys! Come to pop of my little chipsters. I trust that little train matter's been taken care of, Sheriff. All taken care of, Mayor. <laughs> and soon I'll be able to say the same about Marshal Moo Montana. I wouldn't play those five aces, Mayor. What? Well, how, how did they get in there? <laughs> Naughty things. Gentlemen, if you'll excuse me, I have some laws uh, to write. Yeah, yes. Mind if I sit in? Just thought you'd like to know, uh, we found the stolen nitro, Sheriff. Nitro? <laughs> I don't know nothing about any nitro. Really? I thought since you and the mass bull were so close, you might have heard something about it. You saying I'm in cahoots with the mass bull? In three words, yes. And one day I'm gonna prove it. Hey! Looky! Looky there, hey, just like I told you. The wagon tracks lead right into Cowtown. Well, I'm gonna hog tie the mass bull's hide faster than you can say code of the west. Dakota? Get your flea bitten carcasses up! What? I told you to watch the nitro, not the backside of your eyelids. Oh, don't worry, we're guarding that nitro up something fierce, boss. I'll, I'll take care of the whole thing, you oh. nitro brat. Whoops, wrong barn. <laughs> When those do-gooders leave, get the nitro out of there. But in the meantime, get me that kid, Cody. Sure, we don't even need to raisin. Oh, what he said. Hey, open up! Let me in, come on, let me in, open up! <gasps> Hello? Who's there? Yeah, 
<laughs> Someone took all of the nitro, boss. Yeah, and we rigged it underneath the law, Cal. The air float. We sure did. So now, when the float hits the slightest bump... Kaboom! <laughs> Moo burgers all around. <laughs> hmm, I like it. In the meantime, what do we get to do with the kid? Well, since you two brilliant fellows were smart enough to spill your plans in front of the brat, I guess you'll have to dispose of him quietly. We're fixing to dispose of you. Hardly. No, that's that's my hand. What are you doing? Stop it! Take him. Grind him up real good. <laughs> yeah, real good. Hey, y'all. We haven't seen calf pun since yesterday. Say, any of you fellas seen Cody? We'll find the little fella, Miss Lily. Right, Dakota? Yeah. Marshal! Marshal Montana, where are you going, boy? Come on, we've got a Law Cow of the Year award to give out. <laughs> ladies and barmen, uh, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> uh, welcome to Cowtown and the annual Mesa Day Parade. <laughs> Miss Lily. Now this award goes to the varmint, a critter, a person, a person, uh, who did the most to keep the law in order on Moo Mesa. It is with great pleasure that I announce this year's winner, the Law Cow of the Year, our very own Marshal Moo Montana. <laughs> Congratulations, Montana. Oh, thank you kindly, Mayor. I have a feeling <laughs> this might very well be your most explosive Mesa Day ever. <laughs> There you are. Ain't you a sight for sore eyes? Hurry! The last bull's gonna blow up Marshal Moo! We gotta save him. <laughs> Has it happened, giant boss? No! <laughs> Take care of Calf Pine. Me and Dakota gotta save Moo. I thought you sorry sacks of fleas took care of that calf. What? Out of my way! I do everything myself around every crowd out loud. It's a trap!
The Nitro. Your plan. <laughs> plan? What plan? What was there a plan? <laughs> Marshall, I, I think the kind of people in Moo Mesa would like to hear a few words from their favorite law cow. Oh, come on, Moo. Tell them how you feel. Well. I told you, I told you not to take the horses down there. But no! No, it's okay, says you. Water's not deep, says you. So what happens? We wind up up to our black masks in a raging deluge fighting for our lives. I think we should make sure these boys get escorted back to jail. What do you think, Dakota? <laughs> well, 